time to start opening the gift set. Dad there, aunts and uncles, a bunch of the cousins, even Marty, the degenerate, who's an alcoholic by 12. Uncle Donald, he hands me this shiny wee box. He's going on and on. Open it, boy, open it. You'll love the surprise. Thing is, I already know that it's a major Howl action figure. I was a nosy bastard. So, I open it up. I look right at my uncle and act surprised. He sees right through me. <laughs> right? Out of nowhere, Uncle Donnie grabs Major Howell and he kicks him out the goddamn door! Oh, shit! Room goes dead quiet. Uncle Donnie just trucks. He's got to surprise the boy on his birthday. <laughs> Was there a point to your story? Surprises. They fill me with dread and anxiety. Promising start, eh? Anyone read me? That's not too promising. Uh, get a beacon signal, though. Could be the others. They all got cleared to combat. Hope they're out there. What the hell? You're going to the sewer. What about the rest of us? Rooks? Never thought you were a coward. What the hell was that? This place is bringing up some bad memories. Need to get out of here. Hope the others made it. Anybody there? Lieutenant Kaliso, reporting for duty, sir. Glad you made it, soldier. You good? Huh. Nick letting go, but I'll survive. 
Any sign of the outsider? Nick. Kid! You out there? <clears throat> Reunited at last! You made it. Well, thanks to you, Cog. Goddamn maniac kicking me out of a burning plane. Well, outsider, seems like I should get a thank you, seeing as you're alive. You're assuming I want to be alive. Teams back together. Now what? You all follow the beacon, right? Let's find a way up to it. Supplies depleted. This looks like a good way out. Come on. <coughs> Ends at this pit here. Oh, real observer. Uh, this looks like a way through, but uh. Hmm. Problem, sir? The back isn't what it used to be. Especially after that crash. Leave it to me, sir. Just need a moment. That dead tree's caught on some vines. of a ways down, huh? You got a problem with heights? <laughs> After what we've been through, can you blame me? This looks like the way through here. So, either of you know our destination before we left? They didn't tell me shit. All I know is there was ocean beneath us a long time. What the hell was that? Another reason to find that radio ASAP. Well, that is one fucked up plan. There's no way that radio is operational. We need to eliminate it as an option before we move on to another plan. Come on! Look down there. Seen something like them before. My grandmother left the Galandi Islands when she was young. But her photos are from this place. Hell of a way to reconnect with your roots. Must have flown off the plane. <laughs> Thank goodness. My dad always told me I was lucky. Lucky as a locust in a long pants, he'd say. 
So that's why you were picked for the mission. That's all I got. Perfect. Stock up. You can never be too prepared for what's coming. Hey, little help! I hate this place more by the minute. They were saying something about luck, boy? Hey, we're safe, right? Look, some more supplies. I told ya, lucky. What the fuck? A clock! Ah, I stand corrected. How the hell did the swarm get to an island? Sign of the times, old man. The entire world is infected with them. Keep pushing through. Gotta get out of this swamp. We must be the first wave of troops they're sending in. Two soldiers and a driver is exactly what I call a wave. You're a driver. Delivery driver. Award winning. It's Cut! Get out of the way! <laughs> Legion, eyes up! even tougher than the locusts. Well, old man, I for one like our odds. Look at all this. Now we start a fighting shot. You even know how to use half this ordnance? Sure do, Grandpa. My dad taught me to shoot. Ah, you'd have liked him, I think. They're quite similar. Soldier? Ah. Uh. Block! Run the waterfall! What's next, sir? Stick to the plan. Find the wreckage. Find the radiant. Gotta be a way through here somewhere. Goddamn flock. You've seen them before? I fucking swore. Great. Lock. We need to look around. There'll be another way to get back to Condé. There's a way through here. <clears throat> Someone give me a hand. Ugh! <laughs> 
smell again. You ran into it too? <laughs> we gotta get out of here. First the gas, now the smoke. Back right to the frying pan. This looks like the tail end. But any luck, cockpit and radio is up ahead. Hey, lucky. Remember? <laughs> on the other side of the door. Let's go. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it. Guess the radio's not here. The entire cockpit ain't here, Gramps. So what's the plan if we find that precious radio smashed to pieces? There's a good chance that whoever organized this operation is well aware of what's happened. Might take a while. They'll send someone. But if they died in a crash as well, Good work. Now let's find that radio. This thing is absolutely great. Spot the broken ship. Radio. It's a bomb. Sounds like a transponder freight. I'll take a look. I think I've got it. Ow. Hey, you still there? What? Well, you made it. This is Zach. I'm here to get you. Got a location? On it! Why do we get the feeling that Tack isn't the only one we signal? Joey's incoming! Looks like we're gonna have to earn that ride home. Here they come! Don't let them flank us! They were the only ones that heard us.
Cut him down. Far away from this nightmare. Here's the results. Right. Sorry to be late and all, 
We survived a horrific condor crash, fought an endless horde of monsters from hell, and barely escaped with our lives. But uh, how's your day been? Well, it's about goddamn time. Holy shit. What? Show some respect. It's Colonel Victor Hoffman. It's an honor, sir. A real hell of an honor. Shared sentiment, soldier. That's why you're here. Best of the best. This here's Hannah Cole. She's my number one on this covert operation. She knows a lot about science things and uh, is, uh, well, in, in general, quite pleasant to be around. Advanced degrees in biochemistry, toxicology, chemistry, and science things. Thanks, Hoff. Anyway, good to finally meet you. What kind of operation is this? Hannah? Now, what we're looking at is a schematic of the Pahanu Cog Bunker, designation Sanctum. It never served its true purpose, instead becoming a burial site at the end of the Locust War. And now, well, it's a full-blown swarm hive. I need you to infiltrate and plant a chemical bomb at its heart so we can kill them from the inside out. It's a high-risk mission, but if we get this right, we can wipe out those bastards and use what we've learned to save the entire goddamn planet. Now, I've made promises to the COG, and through my people on the mainland, I've made promises to you. Complete the objective, and I will deliver. Questions? Whatever the mission, sir, we're in. What? He's the hell out of retirement. <laughs> Well then, what are we waiting for? All right, team. You'll be infiltrating the base from its main entrance. All of our recon efforts indicate it remains fully powered by the thermal reactors. Once inside, you'll need to access the bottom floor. It's 20 levels down, but the elevator system will ease the burden. What kind of recon operation did you run? We sent a few teams of DBs, but lost contact. The truth is, we needed somebody with access. Keegan, you're up. I'm on. There should be a terminal you can punch your access codes into. Do you see the computer? Commissioning sequence initiated by Special Operations Officer, Corporal Jeremiah Keegan. Welcome to Sanctum. Wait, Corporal? I outrank you? Yeah, long story. All right, guys, now that we have access to Sanctum, I'm officially initiating our operations. Control has assigned your team designation as Scorpio. Copy that, Hannah. Scorpio moving in. must report in with our Sanctum security officers. Please proceed to the waiting area in an orderly fashion. Security officers? Gotta make sure the right people get in. What exactly does the right people mean? Sanctum was meant to protect the most important COG citizens. Scholars, politicians, celebrities. And which category did you fit in, Gramps? The goon working for important people.
So, what about the regular folk? Just leave them out to be locust chow? It was purely a numbers game. Well, they're the resources to save everyone. Except the rich, famous, and connected, of course. This is decontamination. There should be a final security checkpoint on the other side. All citizens of Sanctum are required to undergo decontamination protocol before entering the facility. Please step into a chamber to begin. Initiating decontamination. You'd think with how bad the COG was losing the war, they'd be willing to take in any poor soul that survived. Still need to follow protocol. Protocol, my ass. <laughs> Decontamination complete. Proceed to the briefing room for further instruction. This is my kind of sanctuary. It's engineered as a system. There's an order to it. The real coffin. This is where new arrivals would have been processed. After a proper clearance, of course. So, what happened to us? The volcano powering the thermal generators? <clears throat> Ended up being too unstable. The whole place was deemed uninhabitable. So, after the war, they turned it into a locust burial site. Warning. Biological threat detected. Defensive positions! Retech! Looks like we found your robot, Tana. And they're covered in swarm shit! Damn it! We sent DBs into the ventilation system and... Never heard that. Clear! Swarm infected DBs. There's no end to the cops trying to clean up. Welcome to my life, kid. Keep moving. Further access to authorized personnel only. There should be another terminal around the corner. You're up again, Keegan. On it! Authorization granted. Proceed. Who'd have thought my clearance would come in handy all these years later? I've got the shield! <clears throat> Send on recon to me. A few? A lot, actually. Sorry. For more details of I know the DBs are making your job difficult, but it proves that we need experienced human soldiers to deal with the swarm. 
It's what Hoffman's been saying since the threat first emerged. Glad to hear that the Colonel and I are of similar minds. This panel must be connected to that door. Let's get it open. Let me take a look there, Grumps. Ah, someone installed the fuse from me. Damn, door stuck. Leave it to the superior officer, Corporal. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <sighs> I'd rather die in the sunshine than live on the ground. Give me vast open spaces. Good friend. The hell was that? The seismic activity from the volcano. Oh, is it, is it just the volcano? That's another brilliant cog idea, isn't it? Throw the last of humanity into a fucking volcano. Anyway, the elevators are on the far side of the main hub. What's back here? Let's find out. Hannah, we've got an infestation coming up into the hub from below. Damn. The hive is growing faster than we predicted. <laughs> Looks like the infestation has affected the elevator. Is this weak gas bomb going to do the job? Yes! Yes, of course. As long as you deliver the bomb to the center of the hive, it should work. Should work? Enough. Let's get down there. <laughs> Only 18 more levels to go. What's our best route, Hannah? Out of range. Wonderful. We need to keep moving. Come on. We've got drones. Looks like a small patrol. Come get your ammo. to get to the thermal control room. There should be another access console somewhere. Resupply depleted. The console looks offline, but I'll give it a try. 
No good. Let me try turning it off and on again. Can we please take this seriously? I'll take a look. So I was thinking, why don't we just drop the bomb down the shaft? Looks like it goes all the way to the bottom. Absolutely not. You heard, Hannah. We deploy the payload to the center of the hive. That's the mission. Didn't we want thermal control? Huh. Here they come! Watch it! Come If I wired it right, and I did, both doors should have opened. Access granted. Opening thermal control. Oh, look at that. Just needed some time to think. Let's go. Snipers! Oh, you're kidding me! God damn it, Sonic here. We are in a volcano. Oh, and the actual jets of fire would do it. Come on! There's gotta be a way through. the furnace so you can come through! Shit! 
Can you two argue after we get out of this blocking place? Flock! I think we should take her advice. We need a goddamn army. I am sick of your complaint. There's a door ahead, and we're going through it.
Okay, someone's got to say it. We barely made it out of that one, and it's only going to get worse. We all know it. We are going to die down here. For what? You're afraid of dying? You should have thought of that before you took this on. Oh, believe me, I'm ready to die. But I want to count. Some sort of death wish. Not a death wish, Lord. But when the dust settles, I want to have made a goddamn difference. We're in! Let's go! We will fight our way inch by fucking inch if that's what it takes. We all took this mission to make a difference. And we have our orders, outsider. <laughs> Let's make it count. Look, old lad. All I know is I want our sacrifice to matter. Take a look around. We have to face the facts. The way things are going, this will all be for nothing. So, Lonnie, we almost there. Not even close. Uh, we made it this far. We'll find another way down. <laughs> Goddamn cog. Just can't admit defeat, can you? I'm done taking shit from you, boy. <laughs> to hell with the objective. The hell you doing? Making it count, brother. Deadly toxin detected. All personnel must vacate safety. <laughs> Can make 
make it. We're moving south from the main entrance. Okay, on my way. Drop on standby. Damn. 
Hey, little help? Oh, let me give you a hand there. More precisely, a grenade. Clear! They're still riding at goddamn doors on a river of lava, thanks to you. Correction, riding a goddamn door down a river of lava, alive, thanks to me. Show it! Ah! <laughs> 
Now that's lucky. So everything's a joke to you. Getting pie on the skin of your teeth, flying on your luck. You don't have a clue about working with us. Listen, old man, I don't give a sh- Enough! Hurry up, up ahead! your decision. Uh, well, I think we can all agree the mission was a failure. Not if we uncovered new data. Anything? The drones, Juvies, roasted them. Heavier swarm. We didn't have the punch we needed. You got anything stronger? Mm. Something that can sink the entire island, maybe. But how about a few canisters of that nightmare acid that killed all them bastards on the beach, eh? Damn. You might be onto something. I was joking. Even if that could work, there's a problem. We don't know what's responsible for the attack or where to find it. Why, Leahy? My grand used to tell me stories about her people. How the young men and women would travel the ocean to face a god. It was their rite of passage. If anyone knows something about what we saw on the beach, it's my grandmother's people. Well, go then. Make contact. See what you can learn. Anna, you prep for field work. I want you there to ask the right questions. I'm on it. Let's go, Scorpio. And Hannah? If we obtain some of that nightmare acid from whatever attacked the swarm of Connie, we can combine it with the toxin I was sent from New Hope. Hopefully someone here can fill us in on what exactly that acid is and how to get it. Still have to find a better way to the heart of the hive. Yep. I'm working on a solution to that too. Never thought I'd see where my family came from. Even with all the stories and memories she shared, Grad never told me why she left. Any of your family still live here? Distant relatives, I'm sure. Guess I should introduce myself. Feels like an odd way to reconnect, you know? Marching in, middle of the night. Oh, I'm sure we'll be given a warm welcome. Not every day a band of armed soldiers wanders into town. Well, hopefully they'll be understanding given our rather dire circumstances. Is that... music? Sounds like quite a party. Everyone must be gathered in that hole over there. Couldn't think of a better way to make our entrance. Come on, then. Just trying to find the quickest way to the hall. 
So, Hannah, been meaning to ask. You any relation to the coal trade? Right. Because every coal is related to Augustus. Sorry. Was just curious is all. <laughs> Getting a sense you hear that question more than you'd like to. No, it's okay. I like my dad. I mean, yes. He's my dad. Just please, please don't ask me about the rush. I need to eat. Just this coat. No, I saw him play. That ain't what I remember him for. Man's a legend. A true definition of the cog frontline hero. Yeah, you aren't wrong, Keegan. That's what everyone sees in my father. I wanted to be just like him. A lot of people find it hard to believe, but at home, the coal train is a quiet man. Awfully. His introspection about the war kept me far from the military. He wanted more from me. That's what I fought for, baby. Dad said, one Saren with an education could do more to turn the tide of war than a single grunt with a gun ever could. You mentioned your degrees back when we first met. That's, uh, that's a lot to know for a kid. <laughs> yeah. Mom was always buying me books. Books for my birthday. Books for special holidays. Had books out my ass. Interesting. No, I loved it. I think it was a distraction to keep me away from what my dad was interested in. War. Sports. And I still don't want to talk about thrash ball. How'd you meet Hoffman? Through Dad. Hoffman had the idea for this special project after what happened at New Hope. He got his hands on the New Hope toxin, but he needed a specialist to do anything with it. And so, here I am. Working on a plan to save you. All right. Let's hope there's someone in here willing to help. Well, that all depends on how long their party's been going on. Everyone's gone. Oh, God damn it. Looks like this ain't a diplomatic mission anymore. Did someone turn off that damn radio? Hey, Lonnie. Take a look at this. All this imagery around a creature of some kind. Can you read the language? It's been a long time since Gran told me why Lehan. But I can try. references the awakening. It's the rite of passage she talked about. Listen. The mantle. A terror stalks and desires to consume. Let it be your burden, but let it not feed. The journey. Our ancestors carry you across the world. Their spirits guide and watch over you. A spirit walk. Enter the Fade and journey amongst the ancestors. The path of our people will reveal your burden. The fear. Awaken. Reborn. Renewed, not consumed. Your heavy burden. Transformed. Light as the feather. Face the creature. Huh? Looks like a big fucking bird. A bird? The feathers. Huh? Gran would tell me stories about the Wakatu. A flying demon that all children must face as a rite of passage. Are you suggesting that thing at the beach? Yes. The Wakatu isn't mythology. It's real. That's it. We track this Wakatu down and get a sample of its poison. Hey, after we figure out what's going on here. We'll find the villagers. Come on, Scorpio. 
Let's head into the village. This way. Damn snipers! Shit! How the hell did those bastards get here? How are we gonna handle this? We kill the swarm. Every last one of them.
Where'd they go? They have more use for us alive. Those any pods here, though. They take them somewhere. A defensible structure. That temple up on the ridge. We can still save them. Let's go. You doing okay, Hannah? <sighs> yeah, yeah. I'm good. We Looks like they put up a fight. But not too late. Let's go. There are stories of people who've survived being snatched and caught. But we need to be prepared for the reality that those chances are often slim. I'm not giving up on them. Let's get to the temple. doesn't make sense. Even the locusts couldn't throw between the islands. That's why Sanctum was built on Mohanu. How did they get to Alehi? Ammo's ready. I've got ammo. <laughs> That's it. Just through this door. We still got time to save them. Look, in the tree. He collected feathers from the Wakatu and brought them here. No pods, though. No bodies.
the toxin coming from the feathers. It seems to have some kind of psychological effect. Makes you hear stuff, right? Stuff you'd rather not think about. Yeah. Yeah. But this incense, it's negating the toxic effects. We saw the same incense in the ritual room, back on Pahanu when we first landed. Resupply This proves that we can find the Wakatu. But right now, we need to find the villagers. That's all I got. Let's secure the village. Then, we can go hunting for that Wakatu. One day too late. One day makes all the difference. They're gone. We couldn't save them. So, what the hell are we going to do about it? Make the fuckers pay! Now we're on the same page. <laughs> over Hoffman at full speed when he hears about this little outing. Ammo drop is spent. We're not done with our hunt yet. Get the door. God damn. Look what we've got here. A silverback. I think we can put that wee death machine to good use, eh, Scorpio? We can't move it without power. Mac, this is all you. On it, Keegan. Let's go. 
gonna be a goddamn messy slot. of ground we take back. Definitely feeling the need for a win on their entire species. I still don't understand how they got here from Pahanu. Looks like we found an answer, Hannah. The lava tubes. This is how they got here. Lava tubes? Then maybe they're connecting the islands. Hannah, above you! Nothing I can't handle.
Scorpio, up and over. Hold on. This lava tube, it must lead to Pahanu. The snatch is going back to the hive in Sanctum. Oh, it. Hang on, Hannah. We're bit. coming. <laughs> <laughs> It's getting away! Take out that pillar! Hara! Get to cover! Thank <laughs> you. 
Stole them, potted them, changed them. They wanted to change me too, Keegan. It's okay. You're safe now. We've got to signal Zack. Let him know where we are. Scorpio, I'm seeing a flare on behind you. How the hell did you get off of Wailehi? Long story. That is hurt. We need a stretcher. Copy that. Hang tight. On my way. Where... <coughs> Where are we? All the way back on Pahanu. The heart of the hive. Oh, wow. We got swarm coming! Hannah, stay low! Snatcher was taking Hana to the heart of the hive, and we need a more efficient way to get there. Oh no. You're not suggesting to let them capture us. Hold that thought! Swarm's here!
you think of my plan, eh? Operation Ride the Snatcher? You're serious. We get snatched up. Snatched up and smuggled right into the hive. Then what? There's no guarantee we can survive that. Fair point. But I feel like Hannah and her action science might have an answer for that. Hell. It might work. It's smuggled into the heart of the hive. But we still gotta get out of here first! More swarm on the ridge! Get ready! Oh, I fucking hate surprises! Now! 